It's a little bit of tryout babies. This is the holding tank that they're in until move them into the big tank. But there's a lot, and I'm not sure how many are going to survive. But went to ArizonaFairyShrimp.com to pick these eggs up. It comes with the eggs and then like the starter food and detrius at the bottom of it. So recommend that. It's way better than just getting one of those dinky little kits from a hobby store. Because they only give you like five five or thirty eggs. It isn't really much because with tryouts they kind of like to eat each other if there isn't enough food. So getting a bunch of eggs like this leaves room for mistakes. There might be fairy shrimp and clam shrimp in here, but I'm not entirely sure. I should have gotten some uh, fairy shrimp and some clam shrimp. But this is just a holding tank. The bigger tank, I still need to get gravel for it. But once I put some gravel in it, and um, some live plants, and these guys are big enough, then uh, I'll be ready to go. But they look pretty cool right now. Just tiny white little specks floating in the water. My opinion. Oh, triops are better than sea monkeys. In a couple ways, because if you have the room for triops, then yeah, they're going to be better. But with sea monkeys, but fairy shrimp are a lot easier to take care of. The sea monkeys are brine shrimp, and uh, fairy shrimp are freshwater, so all you have to do is just take some fresh water and then dechlorinate it and then put the fairy shrimp in there and they're not hard to take care of at all. I actually went and set up a fairy shrimp cage. These are the um, tiny little triumphs. They grow surprisingly fast. I think two days ago was when I put the eggs in and just yesterday or a day ago, I was seeing tiny, tiny little specks. And those were the first ones to hatch out, and they're the biggest right now. And then the smaller ones are some of the late ones to hatch. You can kind of tell which ones are the big ones, and just the large white specks. And I think there's a really huge one rolling around in here. But yeah, these are triops, little tiny baby triops, and hopefully we'll have some awesome videos and documentation of larger triops, even bigger than the likes of Captain Squiggles. Right here, I don't even think one adult triop could live in one of these cages, because they need at least like two to one gallon per triop and these little kits they really give you like 10 to 30 eggs and it just won't work Let's see if I can zoom in on Ooh. Well, this camera is really good focus just tiny little specks Radical. Even though this camera's standard definition has some really nice zoom to it. And I think all the scratch marks in the non-moving specs are probably the all the scuffs on the outer hull of this tank. So those are triops. Look forward to more videos soon. Go to ArizonaFairyShrimp.com if you want to pick up some of these. It's pretty cheap and they have a whole lot of varieties of species of fairy shrimp. They have clam shrimp and I don't think they have any different species of triops but I might be wrong but they have a lot of selections of fairy shrimp. 
which are the easier to take care of cousins of the sea monkey, aka the brine shrimp.